child care issues are continuing to be a problem in the Black Hills. State Senate Bill 125 would allow the state to address those gaps. Shelby Peplowski has more. Senate Bill 125 would require the Department of Social Services to conduct a statewide study on child care. Why is that important? Well, if we don't know the cost of child care, we can't really move forward with any type of plan on what's the best way to move forward and make sure that child care is affordable for all families. Key features of the study include the time of year when child care is most needed, licensing types, the age ranges of children in care, and tax reimbursements for care. We, for this bill, we'd be looking at any child under the age of 13. So looking at what those reimbursement rates would need to be for both infants, toddlers, preschoolers, all the way into the school age. If passed, the study will also focus on the impact of inflation, population growth, and the business growth on child care providers. Is that child care is really a workforce issue and we have an estimated $330 million that we lose every single year because we don't address our child care issue. By conducting the study, the state will be able to identify where the gaps in child care are and the findings of the report would have to be finished by October 31st. The bill has not yet had a committee hearing. Reporting in Rapid City, I'm Shelby Peplowski.